After another night of heavy shelling, the strategic eastern city of Severodonetsk is now almost entirely under Russian control. Ukrainian forces, which had resisted Moscow's advance for weeks, were forced to retreat from the city center on Monday. Helped by artillery support, the enemy conducted operations in the city of Severodonetsk. They've had partial success and pushed our troops out of the city center. The fighting continues. Some 500 Ukrainian civilians and as many soldiers were still entrenched inside Severodonetsk Azot chemical plant in a scenario reminiscent of the bloody siege of Mariupol. Severodonetsk represents a key strategic target for Moscow, which is seeking to establish control over Ukraine's eastern Donbass region while fighting on multiple fronts. On Sunday, Russia fired a slew of rockets on the western city of Chortkiv and claimed it destroyed a warehouse containing weapons supplied by the US and Europe. High-precision missiles destroyed a large number of weapons and military equipment delivered to Ukrainian nationalist groups, including some from the United States and Europe. Ukrainian officials confirmed Russian rockets hit a military facility in the area, but said no weapons were stored there. Meanwhile, Kyiv called for more heavy weapons deliveries, including tanks, drones and rocket launchers, ahead of a planned meeting of Western defense ministers on June 15th.